Congratulations on welcome the launch of Welcome to Consent that you've co-authored with Uni Steins. My first question is, obviously, books don't get made immediately. This is obviously something that was in the pipeline for a while, but it feels incredibly timely. What initially prompted you to, to start writing it? And did you change your like writing schedule or uh, publication schedule in response to what was going on? It has been going on in contemporary politics at the moment. Uh, the short answer to the second question is no, there was no change. Um, to answer the first question, as you know, I've worked in adolescent health my entire career in lots of different ways as a researcher, teacher, educator, clinician, and, and answering uh, Dolly Doctor questions for 23 years for that publication. And so consent to me is, is, a, was a no, is a no brainer. It's always been part of my work in all its different aspects. For Yumi and me, we had written Welcome to Your Period together and it was a really fun collaboration and we worked really well together and we just felt there were so many possibilities to sort of continue writing uh, books for young people that could, could talk about many different aspects of, of their life to do with health, I guess, and wellbeing. Mm -hmm. But for both of us, a couple of years ago, we just felt like actually consent, you know, consent is the platform <laughs> upon which to build a whole lot of other work for young people. And we probably arrived at it for different reasons. Uh, Yumi has teenage children. My children are all young adults now. But but consent was just really important to both of us. So we set upon that task, knowing it would be really challenging and really complex than it has been. And look, by the time Media Stories broke earlier this year, and I suppose it started with um, Grace Tame being named as Australian of the Year this year, and things have flowed on from there. But by that stage, the, the book had already kind of gone to print, I think. So we, we had done our job. <laughs> by then um, and you know I, I think the book is now going to be a very useful resource mm, for, sure. for parents for teachers and hope really hopefully for young people themselves absolutely